Hey, thanks for watching Oxog here on YouTube. This is a segment from our full episode. If you want to watch the whole thing, check out our Patreon, or we have a, you know, last week's episode was, was also part of this. Good. All right, here's, here's the topic now. Enjoy. Next topic, uh, Matt, who put this on here? Why is the metaverse so lame? Why is the metaverse <laughs> so lame? Well, I guess we probably have to go to the crankiest, oldest man that doesn't know that there's DMing on Instagram to find out who the uh, who wrote this topic. <laughs> it's me. Yeah. <laughs> it just looks terrible. It looks like VR chat, which I don't, don't even do, but a worse version of VR chat. Like, there's nothing I've seen about the metaverse that's like, yeah, I want to get in Oculus and jump in there. Okay, well, let me turn this around on its head. What would sell you on the metaverse? Nothing. What would sell me on the metaverse? Mm, honestly, honestly, uh, scale down the the headgear somehow. Like, like I want something that's the size of like the AR device. Like the big headgear, I don't like. I don't like having yeah. that on my head. I want scale down the headgear. Yeah, like Google Glass. Yeah, like, like why can't they look like cool sunglasses? Uh, yeah, I'm sure technology that. is the answer, but yes, you yeah. got a point. And then find a way to do it without, uh, find a way to do something interesting in the metaverse that's not just VR chat. I don't know what it is, Joven, because I'm not sitting here trying to make VR experiences, but you got to do something better than <laughs> VR chat. I could, uh, I could tell you what would put, get me into the metaverse. Um, if every single person that bought million dollar homes in the metaverse uh, was put on an island and taken out of society. Then I could say, <laughs> then I could support the metaverse. Wait, that's not fair. Wait, that's not, Where that's I not... live, there's million dollar homes down the street that shouldn't be million dollar homes. Well, no, in the metaverse. So, so They're so buying million dollar homes in the metaverse. They're stupid. They should oh, be taken out of real homes. Got get all their, we should get all their money because they're dumb and they're idiots and they're spending a million dollars on To be fair. Okay, okay, hold on. This is my my problem with the metaverse because there's to, so many different versions of what the heck it is. Like, Lazercorn's talking about meta, right? Facebook's You're metaverse. You're talking about meta quest. You're talking about the blockchain and and people buying... No, like, but, I'm but that is part of the with, metaverse because that was like a... That was someone like tell a me about okay, but, but you know what else now? is also part of the metaverse is like rock concerts in Fortnite, which I think does very, very well. Yeah, so it's like, like there's all these concert. like different, there's all these different like ways of talking about the metaverse. I don't Wait, know which rock one we're talking about. A rock concert in Fortnite counts as the lame. metaverse? Yeah, I guess maybe I don't know what the, I don't know what the metaverse I'm talking is. About, I'm talking about the Zuck metaverse. People didn't, people didn't buy property in the Zuck me yeah. metaverse? Yeah. Buy no, property. I thought you were talking about Bitcoin and the blockchain. No. I am Googling buy property in the metaverse. How to buy land in real estate real estate in the metaverse. People are Article paying by millions Forbes. for land in the metaverse. Yeah. Yeah, but it's idiots. not it's not Zuckerberg's well, metaverse. Huh? I, again, I don't know. it's all confusing and it's all it's see, all equally stupid. See, that's why it's confusing. As, but it's all equally stupid. Yeah, that's as someone point. that doesn't understand what a blockchain is, I I do wonder whenever you see a new social app come by or a new piece of technology, like how do you filter what is going to be the next thing that will form society that will become like you can't just sh 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 on every no I innovative mean, thing. Yes, I can. Let, let, well, <laughs> I will agree with you that every big thing in almost in history was poo pooed by people until it became a big thing. I agree with you, but there is. I just, there is no way that a virtual house, like a house is a practical thing. Okay, a virtual house is not practical. Guess what? If you're standing out in the street in your virtual house, uh, you're going to get rained on and struck by lightning. So it, it's, there's, a virtual house has no use other but, than but having okay, the status of having a virtual on. house. You're dumb millionaires. Give me your money. You don't know how to use it. I would use that money for good, damn it. Give me this your is, million dollars you're spending on This is the problem that I have with this argument. As gamers, the amount of money we have spent on digital goods and digital worlds assets, that we will never skins, actually yeah. live in is like the the, the no, disconnect for me is, is so no, bananas. No, it's it's uh the, first of all, uh, I understand what you're saying, but no because we're we are doing things specifically for entertainment purposes. And uh, to just to cut you off for a second there, I don't play, you know, animal, what is it, island, Cross. whatever, crossing. <laughs> animal uh, island crossing. Animal but, island. But, 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 like, sure, there are those, like, living it, but, like, these aren't for, you know, it's not an entertainment thing other than the entertainment that they get of hanging out in virtual reality with Correct. their other Hold millionaire on. friends. Some people do but, find like, that entertaining. What about art? 
but 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 just let me make this final point. World of Warcraft. Let me let me make this. No, it's not because there's actually like game elements that you can play in World of Warcraft. Number one, but number two, even if you added up all of the money that I have spent on video games in my entire life, it would not even be close. Like nowhere even in the ballpark of a million dollars, and it's definitely only in the thousands. Well, let's say sixty dollars for every game that you've played. Not saying no. that you've had to pay for every yeah, game. Yeah, I haven't, that you've I haven't had to. I haven't had to pay for most of my games for a long time because I've been very fortunate in that. Big way. flex. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Big flex, um, small pp. What? Well, I, I, sure. I, I, uh, I, I doubt. I would doubt that I've even spent, like, maybe it's close to 10000 but I doubt it's even that close. Like, I don't even think, even including video okay, game systems, but I don't take, think I've... So your pain point isn't necessarily Web 3.0's capabilities, but that it is so expensive and that you get nothing back for it. Yeah, millionaires are spending millions of dollars on fake houses. Okay, how and I, and I think there is an answer for this, but I'd like to hear your answer. How is owning a digital home for a million dollars different from a million? Because it's dollar real game? dumb. <laughs> it's it's just real dumb. Is different from what? Uh, owning a million dollar painting. Owning a million dollar painting. I mean, well, okay. So here, here's the here's the difference. I mean, I I agree with what you're saying, but the difference is that some like. Sure, there's like art collectors, and those are the same people that would like buy a million dollar home. But some people own that painting in their house because that is like legacy, and like they can pass that down to their children who then have that value. It's like the same thing as like buying stocks almost. Um, so there is like real world value that could be then used if necessary. For and the like, and the digital house has no, uh, not continuity, but solid investment to it yeah the only yeah yeah the only reason that that is worth like the only person that would also be like value that thing is someone else that's dumb enough to buy that thing <laughs> but also isn't that what's buying and collecting collectibles is what do you mean no for I example mean, you can well, you can you can, like sell, you can have say you found a priceless da vinci in your house you know you I was going to go like, more along the lines of like a Black Lotus from Magic the Gathering. That's fantastic. You know that it's worth $16,000, but then you have to find someone dumb enough to buy it from you for $16,000. Yeah, it's like collectors in this in the in the in the world of paintings, you could sell it to a museum uh, if it was like an actual painting worth value. I did find, um, I found in a Forbes article a a kind of broad definition of the metaverse. Broadly speaking, the technology Broadly speaking, the technologies companies refer to when they talk about the metaverse can include virtual reality characterized by persistent virtual worlds that continue to exist even when you're not playing, as well as augmented reality that combine aspects of the digital and physical worlds. However, it doesn't require that those spaces be exclusively accessed by VR or AR virtual worlds, such as aspects of Fortnite, can be accessed through PC games consoles, and even phones have started referring to themselves as the metaverse. So basically it means nothing. It's any persistent virtual world that's it literally dumb. is video games yeah, yeah. Video okay, games. So I'll, I'll give you the reason why i think the metaverse is lame and it's because of the verbiage of like look at this brand new thing that we've got going on you can you can be with your friends in a digital world and it's like holy <laughs> shit, we've been doing this for a long yeah. time guys why it's are you called it wow sound like it's brand new <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. it's world of warcraft yes. it's a persistent that world is my, I was that is my for with it. 20 years ago and here we are trying to spend yeah. million dollars for i it. will say uh like the advertised uh, uses of the metaverse would make it cool. Like I saw things where it was like, you know, teaching med school students like surgery things and like they can gather around a virtual body and practice on it with no repercussions, you know, if they mess up or something like like using it for teaching purposes. Like to me, that makes sense. Oh, surgery simulator. I've done that. I'm <laughs> yeah. great that at it. I'm great. really good yeah. when you're in the ambulance and the road is bumpy. Yeah. I'm great. <laughs> I What's the bomb? True. The the bomb squad one. Keep talking yeah. and nobody explodes. Yeah. Oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah no, I'm, pr I'm pretty much a bomb squad specialist. Uh, mm. Yeah, I've done all these things in the metaverse. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fun topic. I'm gonna write this one down. 
for later. But if like, your meta mansion is is about to explode from a meta bomb, you call Mari. <laughs> Mari and the SWAT dogs will burst in yeah. there. I need, I need to load up. I need to load up the game and, and the SWAT dogs. You yeah. know, we need to figure out our I communication. Would, um, but we'll, we'll get it done. Yeah. I would be fine. I would be fine with people buying million dollar homes in the metaverse if I could go into the metaverse with and, and just trash their house and like <laughs> just like like blow it up and flamethrowers like that's that is the risk you're taking buying a million dollar house in the metaverse is in the metaverse hey, there's there's no uh policing this reminds me of do you remember Tabuscus had like a toby world in no. minecraft mm -hmm. and server, people yeah. would I was there for the, for the last ever land? super bowl halftime show Oh God, oh that's a topic. God. Maybe for a different that episode. That is a topic. I wish we had video from that thing. It's got to yeah, be out someone there. Does. Someone, someone has it. it. It's not on YouTube. That was the though. YouTube halftime show or whatever. Yeah. yeah, for the Super Bowl, and I sat next to uh, Doctor Drew, <laughs> who turns out to be an anti-vaxer doctor, oh, which no. I don't understand. Well, he's a psychologist, yeah, not a doctor. Doctor. Yeah. Is he? Is he? Yeah. Why does he call himself a doctor? Turns out, turns out that TV doctors suck. Uh, Doctor Oz, for example. Yeah. Oh yeah, Doctor <laughs> Oz sucks ass. Yeah. Doctor Who. No, uh, no, no. <laughs> Doctor Who is not a dr. Period doctor. Doctor Robotnik. He's a period doctor. He doctor exists Robot. in different various times in his <laughs> time period. Doctor Doom. 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 Doom get his doctorate. Yeah. He was a smart guy. Hey, he Doom. built that armor yeah. suit, didn't he? All right. I think we've covered the metaverse as much as it will be covered. Yeah. It's it's kind of a it's just I'd a like to cover it in my pee. I like the pee Yeah, over. cover it in pee. Uh, <laughs> I like how we have differing sort of uh pissed offness of the metaverse. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a good uh, we range. all hate it. So we spectrum. can all agree that it sucks. I, do, I don't like the verbiage. I don't like that it's being posed to us like it's new. Yeah. If yeah. it was exactly it's like a, It's an annoying buzzword. Ready player 1 I'd like it. Yeah. Oh my god! I can't wait till it's that. Yeah, well, I feel we like gotta we... start somewhere. Nah. No, but if you're starting somewhere, don't make it such a big deal. Like, oh, we finally have legs in the metaverse. Come on, Zuck. What? We have legs finally? We've had legs in games forever. Yeah. Ready Player One's dumb though. Also, Zuckerberg's no, metaverse. <laughs> Ready Player One's great. Zuckerberg's metaverse avatar looks creepy as. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah. Live in Who the was based of, off him? of? Uh, we're gonna live in stacks of uh, friggin' mobile homes, so we can. Yeah, look at the housing market right now, so Inky. We're like a decade away from that. We're, yeah, we're talking the about the metaverse is gonna lead us there. Ready Player it's One. Not even, it's, it's not even. It's not even that. It's not even that society is gonna be so bad that we have to go to the metaverse. It's gonna be that people that want the metaverse to succeed are gonna drive society to be that way. Because mm. they all suck. Capitalism. Yes. Everyone that likes not the with metaverse the crypto market sucks. doing what it's doing right now. Crypto yeah, market's it's... back on the rise, huh? Oh, is it? A little good. bit, but it's not Beat these, nearly where it was. Bitcoin's been on a bit of a rally. I know because I own stock in Coinbase, which has made a mild comeback, Joven. You still holding? Yeah, I'm afraid to look. <laughs> it's it's not great, but it's... Kicked. I just need to make it into the black so that you can... Oh, we're, we're miles <laughs> away from the black, Joven, but we're... We haven't lost I mean, as much money as we did for, originally. For those in, that in don't the know, there was a point in time in Lasercorn and my friendship where we would just <laughs> go where, out where I thought drink it would be a, and buy stocks. I thought it would be a good idea. It was a very short-lived phase where I thought it would be a good idea to take stock advice from Jeff. <laughs> I had a <laughs> couple part winners. Of my huh? I had a couple winners. You were there was right to be intrigued. Mm, yeah, I don't know. Uh, you, were hard, letting Joven, you were letting Joven the embezzler money manager. <laughs> yeah, it was. It was uh, there were. I was intrigued by some of the picks, and they didn't. They didn't pan up. Uh, yeah, no, it, it, it says a lot about it. a friendship being friends after stock picks. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah, that's true. Uh, we had to draw the line, and we, yeah. we know we don't do that anymore. Now, when Joven tells me to buy a stock, I short sale. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. The opposite. inverse, yeah. That's the metaverse. Hey, thank you so much for watching this on YouTube. If you are, uh, you certainly are, uh, you can watch the full version on Patreon. Um, if you support us at patreon.com slash ogsog, um, or you can listen to the full version on Spotify. Hope to see you there. Thanks.